All right, finally some uh, some good updates. Got it finished this weekend. Many, many, many hours of work. And after many months of waiting on parts and assembly, it's done. It runs really, really nice. Put about 150 miles on it this weekend. Fixing to drive it to Houston and back on business, kind of break it in. It's got a uh, a tune on it right now based on you have know, a larger uh, turbocharger, larger intercooler, uh, downpipe, etc. Performance cat. Uh, we're, it runs really, really nice, but we are going to put it on a dyno. Tune it in, see what it'll do. Like, see what it'll do on paper. It is very strong for a four cylinder. I mean, it really feels like it's got a coyote in it as far as, you know, a stock coyote. So, I might, by the seat of the pants, I'd guess it's probably, I don't know, 390, 400 horsepower. Uh, that's just a guess. And of course, it's lighter, a little lighter than a coyote. So, it has a nice feel to it. That 10 speed transmission really does the job. So, it came out nice. I'm gonna fire it up. Everything's nice, stock, good old pressure, temps, etc. So, really no issues. Pretty happy with it. A lot of work. I didn't think I'd ever put this much work into a four cylinder, but when one blows up, you gotta do something with it. The car was too nice to just scrap out. So, probably more money in it now than it's worth, but we'll have fun with it. We'll take it to the track. I'll put the dyno information on here, and if we take it to the track, I'll put a video. But uh, hopefully I'm about done with this project and move on, move on to my stuff. Get away from the, uh, the kids' projects. So, till next time. See ya.